Good morning, guys. Today is Friday, May 15th, 2020. And as you can see, I don't have my outline here. I took it to work yesterday to um, kind of go through and make sure that um, I had it for a video conference I was doing. And then I accidentally left it on my desk there. So I didn't realize it until this morning. So today... We're just going to kind of go through the stack of things that you guys have to do, and you can follow along on your <coughs> outline. So in religion, you're going to um, be taking a little mini test on your seven sacraments. You can get your seven sacraments book out to help you. This is a cut and paste. You're going to cut these out. So take the two papers apart, put your name on them, and you're going to glue in the answers, okay? On this one, I totally forgot to wipe this out and change this. This, um, you're going to be filling in the blanks. This actually, guys, I'm sorry, should be two. In other places, second graders receive their confirmation. But here in Florida, we only receive two sacraments as second graders, okay? And we've talked about those two all year. Um, so it's not three sacraments, so make sure you change that. So which two sacraments will second readers receive this year? Which three are the sacraments of initiation? What is the very first sacrament that we receive? What two sacraments are sacraments of service? And which two sacraments are sacraments of healing? Okay. All right, and you can use that. And also this book to help you. Okay, I put these up there to help you kind of see that. Um, for reading, you're going to wrap up chapter 28 in your Super Kids, and you get to find out who the winner is today, who win, who won the voting. And then this is a first, next, then, and last you're going to fill out. Please remember, guys, you're not copying out of the book. Read the story and just retell it, Okay. Four important facts that happen, and when you reread this first, next, then, and last, it should make sense and tell the story. I should be able to read it, even if I didn't read the story, I should be able to read this and tell what happened in the story, okay? All right, when you finish that, you need to do page 73 in your um, workbook on the stories that you've read so far. Okay, you can go back and look in the story if you need to. Then you need to work on day five in your book study. Okay, you should be reading chapter five in your book study. All right, for math, we're skipping over the break apart model. Um, it's just, it's not something I want to show you on video. We're just going to stick with that, those standard algorithms that we're used to. Okay, so you're going to do the review today. Okay, same thing you've been doing. I'm getting ready for that test on Monday. When you get to this one, you're going to cross it off and you're going to rewrite it as the standard algorithm over here, stacking them on top of each other, okay? All right, guys, that's it for math. Send me a picture of that when you're finished and also make sure you get on your reflex math. For science, you have a science test to take. This is an open book test. Go back and look in your book, guys. Don't just guess. If you're not sure about one, definitely go back and double check it. Let's take a look at the essays. This one, it was worth four points down here. This is the life cycle of a bean plant. Step phase one, two, three, and four. You have to write four sentences for this, guys. You're, this is worth four points. Describe what's happening in each one. I want you to use words like germinate, um, sprout, adult plant, okay? Um, and then make sure you describe two ways roots and stems are alike in the jobs that they do. That one's worth two points. All right, and then in social studies today, you guys read about wants and needs yesterday. So today, you're going to do use these words to sort them into needs and wants. Okay, you do not have to do the bottom. I didn't realize that on the back they were having you draw a picture, so just ignore the bottom. 
and then take your wants and needs quiz. And this is where you'll actually draw pictures of a need and a want and label it. Okay, guys, I will be on Zoom at 10 a.m., but we are not having our 7 p.m. Zoom tonight. Ms. McClellan has something else going on with her family. All right, guys, have a great day.